really you call <laughs> you might call it a semi final for us it's another game you don't have to do something different is it recording maybe confirm we're recording are we recording we won't get it again go on we are recording thank you Venue for this first semi-final. It's India against New Zealand. I like you want to say something. You want to go, take a minute. Getting a call. <laughs> How do you think Indian fans would feel if India lost um, at this stage in the tournament to New Zealand? Exactly the way New Zealand fans would feel if they lost. <laughs> so it's it's quite natural. I mean, everyone feels disappointed when you come to a stage of the tournament like this and you don't make it through. As a batting unit, you guys pride yourself to be very flexible, and we've seen that over the last two years. And there've been a lot of changes in this tournament: Rahul moving up. Shankar, Pan, you know the changes. Um, <laughs> how ha <laughs> how would you describe the evolution of your batting lineup in this tournament, and how it has impacted the way you have batted personally? I'm glad you didn't say. Is it the ideal eleven? <laughs> <laughs> I think knockout games you need to be very precise, at the same time being intense. So I think that balance. It, this is more similar to. You know the, the toughest situations you'll get in Test cricket, where you have to be absolutely precise, but your intent cannot go down. It's probably up there, isn't it? Up there with one of the biggest ones. I mean, my first World Cup and to be in a semi is pretty, a pretty awesome spot to be in, and you always want to play in front of as many people as you can. Game plan? What's it going to be? <laughs> Win. <laughs> How do you deal with Rohit Sharma at the moment? Uh, I don't think you, you stop players like that. I think look, they have the records they have because they're, they're fantastic players. And um, I think Rohit's breathing down the neck of Virat now as, as the number one ODI batsman. And that's just a testament to their consistency over the last four or five years. He just toured New Zealand. I think they were in India some time, some time ago. So both oppositions know each other, and uh, you know they know what to expect. You know we know what to expect. You might call it a semi-final for us. It's another game. You know stick to what you have been doing. What happens after that will happen. This crew this is, is all about love. It's a sunshine crew. <laughs> yeah. We don't hold our talent. Yes, please. Right, stand by. In five. It's all about love. 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 Yeah. Is it recording? Evie, confirm we're recording. Are we recording? We won't get it again. Go on. We are recording. Thank you. Well, it's ICC Cricket World Cup semi-final time. It's New Zealand against India. Sanjay Mandrake alongside me. What are your thoughts, Sanj? How are we going? Uh, well, I think the big story is going to be New Zealand. Ferguson, Bolt, Williamson. Okay. Guptul's due. Martin Guptul's due, isn't he? Surely. You'll see all the typical talk of, uh, you know, not minding who our opponents are in the semi-finals and all that. But India would have been ecstatic when South Africa beat Australia because they didn't want to play England. Yeah. They'll be happier playing New Zealand. So that's something they've got to worry about, not to take it too easily. Move back, move back. Come on. Yeah. Because yeah. India need to hit the ball into the grandstand. To no, win. You know, you, I'll to, tell to you what, win. what has need? been India's Come secret. On. I'll tell you. Just right, bowl the ball. Just, just bowl. Just bowl the ball. And here you go. Dead defence, laying a good foundation. That is what. That Classical. would be a perfect ball, wouldn't it? Like yes. a second bounce Yorker. Imagine <laughs> how good a two bounce Yorker would true, be true. if you could perfect it. Let's yeah. see if someone tries that tomorrow. You're yep. back in India, aren't you? <laughs> Chances? Anybody can win on a good day. I hope it's a good day. <laughs>
going to be the venue for this first semi-final. It's India against New Zealand, the powerhouse of India against the underdog New Zealand. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, Team India. Good morning, Team New Zealand. Welcome to Old Trafford to the Cricket World Cup semi-final. Itch and gone, gone, gone. Gattu's woes continue, and Bumra has struck an early blow. Super, super, super shot. 79 balls and four fours for Emily since 5,531 runs in the tournament for him now. That is crucial. Williamson has been the backbone of this New Zealand batting side. Just the wicket in they were hoping for. It's all right if you got good company. It's okay. <laughs> it's just that there are so many possibilities that you, until the rain stops, you never really know in whose favor it is. Day number two, we were here yesterday, but we're back. India's going to take it all the way. Feeling pretty confident. Uh, I think uh, boys can knock off a few runs this morning, make India chase 230, 240. With the extra moisture on the wicket today, um, Trenty will come out and he's going to get the same movement going, and we're really going to crack through the Indian top order. It is. 
Yes, it is. It's over. It's over. Latham takes the catch. All the credit in the world goes to that man on screen, Kane Williamson. We knew we had the team to, to go to the final in this tournament. And uh, we've probably snuck through the back door. I think it's well documented the way we've been talked about in this tournament as underdogs. But um, look, now it's just one game and um, we don't know who it's going to be against yet, but we're just looking to prepare for Sunday.